Okay, so when I was at the co-op, I was watching a movie. So I had um, decided I would finish it in the car because, you know, Crystal Vanner was talking about, oh, well, she watches videos in her car. And I know, again, my windows are not dark, that dark. But I had listened to something the night before, and I just, you know, covered up my phone and put one earphone in so I could hear what's going on outside still. And I just kind of sat in the seats here, which I'm finding are more comfy because I can lay my legs out. And this section, middle section, is warmer than the back. Yeah, I'm learning these things. It takes me time. So um, I had listened to the, video, the uh, audio the night before, and I thought, well, maybe I can just finish the video there. So that's what I did. I came back after calming down, and I watched the rest of the movie. It's a very interesting kind of odd movie on Netflix. So anyway, <clears throat> that was kind of the end of the night. I had my little thing at the very back fall at one point, but I just taped it back up. I gotta fix that thing. Um, actually, if I think if I cut some of the old tape off, it'll help. It's just got layers and layers of tape on one level, and it, it is just not sticky as well when I try to tape it up. Anyway... So that was the end of the night. Um, I was going to show you a couple things today. One was, even though I don't have the setup like everyone else, there are things that have to be organized. I am an organization person. So what I have for things that are cold, or actually basically my food bag, everything that's all closed up, never been opened, I have it in a sack. It's actually a Nordstrom bag. But it's inside another bag. And so it looks kind of tacky, but it works. I'll try to show you. So I have this bag. Here, I don't know why I don't unplug. Okay, so here's the bag. I don't know if you can see the bag. Can you see the bag? I'm trying to. Oh, wait, how about this way? I don't know. I'm trying to show you the bag. Oh, okay. This is crazy. I don't know why I can't show you the bag. Anyway, it's a bag inside of a bag. And it's very cold in there. I don't know why I'm not able to show you that. Huh. I don't know. Anyway, so it's a bag inside of a bag. And, um, you know, everyone's like, why are you wearing your winter coat? Well, like I said, it's chilly here. And I have never had any problems with that bag staying cool. And again, everything in it is pretty much closed. It's not like things that need to go in the refrigerator. Refrigerator. But um, there are things that are cooling there. Things that don't have to be refrigerated before you use them. For instance, this, this container of Milk Rebel chai drink it doesn't have to be refrigerated it's just in there because you know out of sight um mostly i have soups i have little uh boxes of soup packages of soup um my seaweed snack so anyway pretty much everything my granola when I, when I get yogurt at night, I'll put it in here because it's just overnight. And again, it's cold at night. So I could have it over there, over, in there overnight and it's no big deal. So anyway, that's kind of where, and what I do is I close this bag. And then I cover on top with this other bag. Partially just to cover it up. But also because it's gotten to where it fits now. So it's just a bag. A bag and a bag covered by a bag. That's one thing I have. And then at the very back, I think I kind of already showed you or told you that I had two stacking things. There, there are more because I didn't want pl a lot of plastic in here because of toxins. I got the kind that are more. Um, they are more. I don't think I'm gonna be able to take you back there without running out of time but they're like they're stacked and they are made out of fabric so there's a couple of bags in the in the 
second area back there behind that seat um where the water you see the water on the floor that's there with the bungee i don't know if you're able to see any of what i'm trying to show you anyway so i have that organized back there and then the very back where the suitcase is i have a few of the same um, organizer things and then i have some um the store bags that you buy that are reusable and then I have two pillowcases with my clothes. Um, I have a uh, spring bag that I'm probably just going to get rid of if I stay up in this area. If not, I'll need them when I go to the warm place. Um, and then the ones that I'm using right now. Plus, I think I showed you this one. My laundry bag here. Ah, my trusty laundry bag that needs to be clothes washed today or tomorrow um i don't even know why it seems big because i don't anyway that's the laundry bag and then i have besides the laundry bag i have my laptop but i cover that up with the sheet that i put up every night that's got a black part on it so if you're passing by looking in my windows I have the black part on top and it just looks like darkness okay that's my little tour I'm sorry if you didn't get to see any of it okay and also I have I went to the thrift store yesterday and I didn't go to buy anything but I found a couple things that's what happens when you get a little bitty check right but they're only three bucks a piece so I got a simply Vera Wang shirt it's very graphic. I'll go with my uh, purple sweater or whatever. Just long sleeve. I like long sleeves because you can layer them. I'm one of those people that layer short sleeves over long sleeves in the summer because I'm always cold. And then my other, I got this 60s kind of shirt. The guy at the counter thought it was awesome. He goes, I love that shirt. He said, I, I know I'm a man, but I have a, a man version of it. <laughs> it's got flowers on it. It's a very 60s, but it's kind of cool. It's kind of a nitty polyester. I tried it on, and it has, you know, all those funky 60 colors, the browns, and it's got a, um, it's a shirt, but it has a cool texture to it. So I got those two. And then, the other night, well, these, because they have to be washed, I gotta go back in the bag. At the, um, thing the other night she gave me these two things that she says are defective right so I got the brown hat the only thing missing is like a button or something here I'm gonna put one of my one of my things from my uh, jewelry up there so I'll have probably I'll probably end up putting a button and this shirt that has a tiny tiny hole so she couldn't sell it it's like it's a little big but, you know what? I'll make it work. It's kind of green and gray. This is a $60 shirt. She just handed it to me. All right. <clears throat> Maybe you can sell that eBay. <laughs> but I love hats, as you see. I like things in my head. Um, I don't know how much she was selling this for. This is just, um, wait, it does have a tag in it. No, nope, doesn't have a tech on it. But it's a tweed hat. It's brown. And so I have to get a brown jacket. You know, that's just how it goes. Anyway, so that's my tour for today. It's already been nine minutes. I hope you got to see something and enjoyed it. And since I have several hours since I have to be at work, I'll probably be rambling on something else in a minute. But this is the end of the official Renee and Blueberry talk for today. Bye! Bye!